Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Fallout 3. And, uh, wow, that has been, uh, it's, it's been a quite a long time since I've said that. <laughs> uh, it feels kind of unnatural. I was getting into a habit of, like, saying my little opening, little introduction thing. Uh, but it, it's feeling unnatural. But, uh, hopefully it'll come back to me fairly quickly. And, uh... I think it should, if I can stay consistent <laughs> with my, uh, my uploads. But yeah, we are back again on full- Oh my god. It's killing time. Uh, please die. Ah. Oh, what? Oh, come on. Just die, die, die. Thank you. Thank you, game. Oh boy. That's, uh... That almost gave me a heart attack. <laughs> uh, uh... I don't even remember what we were doing in Fallout 3, to be honest. Um, let's check our pip boy. Um, quests. Following in his footsteps, find Galaxy News Radio. Okay, uh, where's the... Uh, where we... Yeah, we need to go in the, the metro over there, down the subway, I think. And, um, I think that should take us the direction we need to go but yeah how are uh how are you guys doing it's it's been a minute <laughs> uh can we oh boy he's running he's running boy let's use vats come on that should be doing more damage when i was it just me or when i clicked in to go into vats it said that like if i hit him then it was gonna be like a one-shot kill. I don't know. Maybe I'm just imagining things. That was a one-shot kill. Very clean. I'm really, uh... From what I remember, the hunting rifle was a pretty good weapon <laughs> that I was using. Oh, and awesome, we found another hunting rifle and some ammo. Can we repair the two so that we can get a better one? No, we can't. Not quite yet. Can we repair some of these assault rifles? Jeez, we have a lot. Oh wait, hold up. We can repair one of them into another. But let's continue to use our scoped hunting rifle. Who do we kill? Oh, we killed this guy here. <laughs> he has a bottle cap. I'm trying to remember all the controls. <laughs> it's, uh, it's coming back to me. Slowly but surely. And what way do we need to go down here? Uh... Looks like we have to head northwestish, so we will continue on down the tunnel. Yeah, but um, I'm sorry that <laughs> that I haven't uploaded in nearly a month. I actually I think it's been a little bit more than a month now, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I honestly don't know what happened. I've just uh. Can we kill this guy, please? Just die. You're running at me too quick. I don't appreciate it. Thank you. Um, <laughs> yeah. I just, I don't know what happened. Because I was on a pretty good streak for a while. And I think my upload schedule was alright. I was pretty much uploading every day, if I remember correctly. Um, but yeah, something, something happened and... Then another thing happened, and I just kept on getting delayed on uploading videos, and one week turned into two, and then two turned into a whole month, and yeah. So, sorry about that, but hopefully that won't happen again anytime soon. Um, but we are in Chevy Chase, uh, which I think we are getting close to the Galaxy News Radio building so hopefully we will arrive there fairly soon oh wow things are not loading in for some reason <laughs> uh, let's see yeah I think we need to head this way is there anything over here though I see a little Chevy Chase North okay there's another metro area is there anything in this uh 
this pull. Oh boy. I did not see that. <laughs> Anything in this preservation shelter? Teddy bear. A lead pipe. We don't really need that. Purified water. We will take these though. I don't think there's really anything else over here besides that. More teddy bears. <laughs> and some sort of cleaning machine. Uh, let's see. There's another preservation. Oh, it's a super muted. Oh boy, there's lots of them. Uh, what's our hotkeys? The BB gun? Oh, uh, shotgun. Okay. Can we, like. Are they fighting each other? Yes, please kill each other. Thank you. Okay, what's over there? Are those- okay, I think those are Brotherhood of Steel. So they should protect us, I think, hopefully. Uh, a dead corpse, that's no good. Uh, wait, are they shooting at us? Please don't. I'm friendly. Lots and lots of hunting rifles. Can we repair any of them together? Uh, we can. Okay. Cool. Just free up some room. There's a bed here. Can't sleep. Uh, let's see. Oh. Look, I don't know who you are, but you don't belong here. The super mutants have overrun our brothers at the Galaxy News radio building, and we're headed there to back them up. You can tag along if you want, but keep your head down and try not to do anything stupid. Hey, I'd never do anything stupid. And who the hell are you people? I'm Sentinel Lions of the Lions Pride. With the Brotherhood of Steel. Yeah, I think I Don't answered worry, that we're on your like side. a minute ago. <laughs> at least I hope so. Uh, at least you guys won't kill me. Uh, you mentioned something about Galaxy News Radio? There aren't a lot of safe places in the ruins right now, but the Galaxy News Radio building is sort of our port in the storm. Unfortunately, the building's been hit pretty hard lately. We're their backup. So if there are no more questions, we really need to move out. Okie dokie. Um, I guess we should go Watch now. Watch yourself out there. Alright, yeah. Let's run ahead. Let's try and loot some things along the way. Anything in the garbage can? Ooh, lots of bottle caps. <clears throat> lots of propaganda. Oh boy. Was he trying to run in here? You got a sledgehammer. Five from their torment, the rest are keeping their heads down. Good. Jennings? Negative. A new recruit? Just a stray we picked up. The one that blundered into the uglies over on 42nd. Welcome. All right. Thank you. The usual drill. <laughs> Redden, you just do whatever Paladin Vargas says and keep your mouth shut. What's wrong, Mr. Yeah. Vargas? Are you okay? <laughs> Ooh, energy cells. Don't mind if I do. Oh boy. Lots and lots of super mutants. Uh, I don't have a good shot. Oh wait, did I get them? I don't think I did. <laughs> Where are they? Are they up on the second floor? I can't see them. I didn't hit them. Aw oh, man. These Brotherhood of Steel are putting in work. So many... Hunting rifles, seriously. I I can't keep all these. There's there's so many. <laughs> Wait, hold up. Uh can we repair some? Wait, no, I don't keep on meaning to do that. Uh cancel. Can we repair any others? There are so many. Oh boy. Oh boy. He disintegrated. So many hunting rifles, I feel like I should stop taking them. Like, I'm really tempted to keep on taking them. Oh my god, these guys are OP. They are... Oh wait, okay, I'm not gonna take this hunting rifle. I'm gonna limit myself. I'm going to restrain. And I'm not doing anything. These guys are putting in all the work. <laughs> uh, Where is every... Okay, I already looted you. Oh, you guys are down there. Okay. Uh, guess I'll drop down here. The outpost is just to the south of us. Colvin, you're the eyes. Vargas, Redden, secure this building. All right. Cool. What is this? Assault rifle. And uh, I am over encumbered. That's great. Uh, 
We're good now. We're Gucci. Grab some more ammo. Love that. Five five six ammo. And were you gonna say something to me? I don't know. <laughs> oh boy, more supermans. Oh no. Ow. 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 I want those targets down now. Got one. Oh no. Gotta reload. No, man, they're just taking all the XP away from me. This isn't fair. So, how did I do, Vargas? Past my little trial run? Come on, Lion's Pride needs me and you know it. That Citadel guard duty is such bullshit. We're clear out here. Yeah, yeah, we'll see. They had the whole now place surrounded. Off. You're wasting ammo. Should we take some of these assault rifles and, like, repair them? <laughs> I know I'm, like, repairing so much crap, but it's, like, it's the looter in me. Like, I gotta just have, like, every little bit. I don't know why. I'm sorry, guys. I know this is probably boring. <laughs> uh, let's just drop this one. Okay. You think those were all the uglies in D.C.? You take the east side. I'll go west. Okay, okay. Once we're inside, then we'll sell them. Am I supposed to be listening to their conversation, or do I need to go somewhere? I think it said go and talk to three dog. <laughs> I'm just... Oh boy, what's happening? Why is there a loud noise? Where is the loud noise coming from? Oh boy, what the hell? Uh, 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 what? What are you? What are you? What did you say? Get the fat man? What fat man? I don't see any of them. Uh, 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 what? I don't see a fat man. Are you a fat man? Are you dead? Uh, 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 die. Die. Please die. Please die. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Please. Please die. Ow. Oh boy. That was a close call. He was about to smack me in the face with that fire hydrant thing. Oh boy, my laugh flash. My, my, my laugh flash before my eyes. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I don't know why I had like a southern accent there. I don't know. Maybe I didn't have a southern accent. I was just imagining it. Uh, but, <laughs> but, um. Oh, what am I doing? There's so much stuff in my inventory right now, and we're so over-encumbered. We need to find someone to sell this crap to. Seriously. Uh... I don't even know what I want to get rid of. Uh, I guess we don't need a 32 millimeter pistol. Uh, let's drop this... Uh... uh uh, yeah, let's just drop some hunting rifles. <laughs> we don't need all those. Oh, this is the fat man she was talking about. But now I'm fat and I can't run. Um, should we keep the fat man? It does a lot of damage. Jeez, okay. It has 30 weight, though. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, I don't know what to get rid of. I have so much garbage in my inventory. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna put this fat man back on top of you until we can find a merchant to sell some stuff to. And we might come back to you and try and find you and do stuff to you and get the fat man. Looks like it's all clear. Unlocking outer doors. Cool. Let's go inside. Oh boy. Well, this is a lovely place you got here. GNR Studios. Three dog. The look on your face says it all. You're wondering who the heck this guy is and why you should care. I know who you are. Well, prepare to be enlightened. You're three dog. I am. Three dog, I knew it. Jockey of discs and teller of truths. Lord and master over the finest radio station to grace the wastes. Galaxy News Radio. And you? Well, I know who you are. 
Heard about you leaving that vault, traveling the unknown, just like dear old Dan, huh? Met him already. Wait, you did? Uh, you know my father? Is he here? Please, I've been looking for him. Hey, hey, one thing at a time. Nah, your old man ain't here. Not anymore. He heard old Three Dog on the radio. Figured I knew what was what out here in the Capital Wasteland. And he was right. So I filled the old man in. But he split. Looks like I've got my way of contributing to the good fight, and he's got his own. Guess so. Uh, the good fight? What's that all about? Imagine a picture, okay? A picture of the Capital Wasteland. All that brick and rock. A whole lot of nothing, right? There's people out there trying to just barely make it from day to day. Fighting to stay alive and make something out of what they got. But then you've got all kinds of shit. Slavers, super mutants, raiders. They all want a slice of the pie, too. And aim to take it by force. Uh, so what's this about the good fight? Patience, patience. Three dogs like a minstrel. Give him some time in your ear and he'll soothe the soul. Okay, okay. So back to the tale. I fight the good fight with GNR as my gun. The truth goes out across the Capital Wasteland and with it, the word about the good fight. Uh, I'm amazed you're still alive. <laughs> oh, I have plenty of enemies that would love nothing more than to put a bullet between my eyes. The only thing keeping that from happening is Sarah Lyons and the Brotherhood of Steel. We brokered a sweet deal. They keep me from taking a dirt nap, and I keep a strong roof over their head. Uh, that's a good deal. Um, I understand your fight, but I still need to find my dad. Sorry. I'm so used to talking to an audience that can't answer, I just assume you want to hear my voice all the time. So, you want to know where your dad is? Fair enough. We got one rule in the good fight, though. You want help, you gotta contribute. Alright, alright. Uh, if you know anything that can help me find my dad, please just tell me. You wanna find your dad. And it just so happens his location is known to yours truly. He was here with Galaxy News. We had a great conversation. He's a real stand-up guy. If you want to know more, you're going to have to contribute to the good fight. What the hell is this good fight? Uh, all right, I'm going to try and take this speech check. Look, Three Dog, if I find my dad, maybe he can help with the good fight. Well, oh, it actually your worked. Your dad is some sort of <laughs> scientist type. Some kind of egghead or something. You really think if you find him, he'd help our cause? I'm really surprised that worked. That was like a 16% chance. Um, I know he will. He's always talked about doing what's right. When your dad passed through here, I spent a good long time talking to him about all kinds of stuff. He mentioned some scientific mumbo-jumbo, which didn't make much sense to me. Hmm. Something about a Project Purity. He also said something about going to visit a Dr. Lee in Rivet City. Then, he left in a hurry. Rivet City? Where's that? You've never heard of Rivet City? Wow. I've been living in a freaking Just, vault for 18 wow. years. Well, a whole bunch of eggheads got together and turned a beached aircraft carrier into a town. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? Just follow the river south from here. There's no way you can miss it. All right, all right. Thank you, Three Dog. I appreciate the help. Quest completed. Following in his footsteps. That's good to know. Can we sleep? Oh, we can. Awesome. Wait, what? Did I just sleep with three dog? Ah, uh, I didn't think it was gonna happen again. I thought it was a one and done deal, three dog. Um, uh, <laughs> let's see. Let's check our quest book. Uh, scientific pursuits gain entrance to Rivet City. Okay. Okay. Oh, I'm perfect with the Wasteland Survival Guide. Learn the history of Rivet City. Um. We've got a lot of quests, but I think a handful of those are DLC quests as well. Let's actually check our map. Oh boy, so it looks like we have to go back down into the metro, and then we have to take some things, and we have to get to Rivet City. <laughs> uh, that should be fun. But before we do that, let's try and look around in this building and see if there's anything we could steal from 3Dog. Even though he just helped us. <laughs> 
with finding our dad. Uh, anything useful here? Big book of science. I'll take that. Don't mind if I do. Let me use that. I think it's aid. It's in. No. Miscellaneous? No? Wait. Aid? Oh, wait. I didn't see that. Maybe I'm blind. And I just, like, completely missed that. <laughs> uh, uh, radio toolbox. Nothing good in there. Detergent. Mm. Anything in this room? Ooh, basement? Basement? Ooh, basement. Where did DuPont circle? Okay. That could be fun. <laughs> Sleeping in a rented or owned bed will give you a well-rested bonus perk that boosts your earned XP for several hours into my game freeze. Oh, boy. Alright, guys. Sorry about that. My uh, my game did freeze. Let's try and go into DuPont Circle without freezing this time. And we can. And we are up on top of a building. We are high up. Uh, see if we could drop down here safely without dying. What's this? Clipboard? Filing cabinets? Anything of interest here that I could use? Uh, oh boy, oh boy, okay, okay, okay. I've trained all my life for this. Use vats. <laughs> oh, why did you not die? Why did you not die? You dead now, sucker. <laughs> uh, blue pass card, what is that? Ooh, car and a cigarettes too. I'll take that, why not? Uh, blue pass card. Wait, I dropped it. Crap. Maybe it'll let us get into somewhere. There's another one of these guys. Why? So many. At least he died in one show. Buff out. Alright, wait. Uh, wait. There we go. <laughs> like I said, I'm still getting used to the controls again. Um. Let's see. Are we gonna be able to, like, go into one of these subway stations and get to uh get to rivet city there we go that was a terrible shot but <laughs> it worked um uh, let's see is there anything down here can we go into the bus oh we can't door to collapse car tunnel that sounds fun Oh boy, um, it looks, <clears throat> it looks like this might take us close to Rivet City, Duponte Circle, <clears throat> wait, where are we now? It's Dupont Circle Station, okay. Oh, this looks like it might take us to Rivet City. Cool, okay. Um, ooh, can we hack this terminal? Let's see if we can do it. Oh boy, this is never good. Uh, stuff. 205 correct, okay. So with that knowledge, let's try stays. 3 of 5 correct, okay, we're getting closer. So I'm guessing it's ST and something. S-T-A-K, okay, so could it be S-T-A? Three of eight. Okay, so it could be S T A. Uh, let's try and get some some attempts. Uh, wait, four attempts. Okay, so stand. Yes, we got it. Okay, that was a pretty easy one. Sometimes it can be pretty difficult. What can we do? Activate Metro Protectron. Turn on Metro Escalators. Turn on Metro Lights. Let's try on Metro Lights. Failure. Call for maintenance for assistance. Dang it. Okay, let's try on the escalators. Failure? What about the Metro P Protectron? Protectron activated. Okay. Cool. Are you gonna kill me? Or will you Metro. be my friend? Security protocol initializing. Station security grid offline. 
Metro. Threat right. level Omega. Threat level Lethal Omega. Force. No, it's Authorize. threat level midnight. Protect and serve. Protect and serve. Okay. Thank you, Protectron. I hope you will protect me. Anything else here? More filing cabinets, bottle caps. Well, I grabbed a clipboard. I guess we're keeping a clipboard. <laughs> Are you going to kill everyone, Move Protectron? Along, please. please. Go and kill everyone. No, get outside. Go. Go kill everyone. Ah! Wait, oh. Just ow! Go! Go and kill him, Protectron! I didn't let you out for nothing. Kill him. Kill him. Shut the door. You got this, Protectron. I believe in you. Oh boy. No, you don't got this, Protectron. You don't got this. Ah! Oh boy. Uh, uh. Well then. He, uh. He went kablooey. Oh boy. Die, die. Thank you for dying. Thank you for dying. I really appreciate it. Uh, <laughs> More hunting rifles. So many hunting rifles. It's not even funny. And we leveled up to level 6! Yay! Um... What am I leveling up? I don't even remember. I think I was leveling up my explosives so I could get to 25 so that once we got back to Megaton, we could disable that bomb, I think? So what am I going for now? Um... Oh, science. We could get to 50 so we can unlock the the harder terminals and then what else should we put let's put five of the small guns so that we can round it out to 50 and then let's do another what else should we do what else should we do lock pick is good hmm I kind of want to put a couple into speech. Yeah, let's get our speech up to 40. Let's put one into poc- or pocalip lockpick. <laughs> um, let's see. Uh, all the level 6 ones. Bloody mess. With the bloody mess per characters and creatures you kill will often explode into a red gut-ridden eyeball strewn paste. Fun. Oh, and you'll do an extra 5% damage with all weapons. That could be really good. Destiny's Gambler. Life is full of surprises. With Destiny Gambler perk, you will be able to throw the dice of destiny at random combat situations. Let your luck guide your fate. That could be interesting. I have no idea what that means, but I'm very intrigued to try it. <laughs> um, Fortune Finder. With the Fortune Finder perk, you'll find consider considerably more Nuka-Cola caps in containers than you normally would. That's always good. Gunslinger, while using a pistol or similarly one-handed weapon, your accuracy in vets is significantly increased. Lead Belly, with the Lead Belly perk, you take 50% less radiation every time you drink from an irradiated water source. Uh, roach Lover, with the Roach Lover perk, you will be able to make any red roach to follow you for a long period of time. I like that one. I really want to try that one. <laughs> Uh, Steed. Those who are born under the sign of Steed can run faster than others. With each rank of the Steed perk, you will be able to run faster. Toughness. With the Toughness perk, you gain 10% to overall damage resistance up to the maximum of 85%. Oh boy. There's a lot of level 6 perks. Uh... How do I get Will of the Creator perk? True creator of a weapon knows the true potential of the creator weapon. With Will of the Creator perk, the schematic weapons that you create will deal more critical damages. It says the only requirement is level 6, but I am level 6. Racist. <laughs> your reactions and ideas come from the very deep part of your heart. You will inflict more damage against the ones who are not your race. <laughs> oh boy, that's an interesting perk. <laughs> um... Father's will. Following your father's footsteps, you will change the quality of water for the wasteland has started from your own inventory. Any dirty water you collect will automatically become purified. That's a really good one, actually. Why can I not unlock it? It says requirement level 6. 
Um, I'm spending way too much time here, though. <laughs> um, oh, man. Some of these perks are really cool. Dest I want to trade their Destiny's Gambler or Roach Lover. I'm going to go Destiny's Gambler for now. We might come back to Roach Lover. Because I want to have, like, a rad roach friend. <laughs> uh, die of Disaster added. Die of Fortune added. What? Die of Disaster... 666-777. Oh, boy. This is going to be an interesting perk, isn't it? <laughs> uh... Does the Protectron have anything? Ooh, okay, some energy cells. Nuka Cola? Ooh, Quantum. Where does this lead to? Metal Gate to DuPont Circle. Where is that? Uh, DuPont Northwest. Okay. Yeah, that's not where we need to go. <laughs> Oh boy. Yeah, but uh, oh boy. As I was gonna start talking. Just die, Raider. You're no good. Alright. <laughs> it's good that he's dead now. Because I was gonna try and make some small talk. Um, you know, I even remember what I was gonna say now. I think I have short term memory loss. And why is there enemies nearby? I don't see anyone on our compass thing down at the bottom corner. Ooh, we have an ammo box, though. Ooh, some nice ammo. Another ammo box. We will take all of that lovely stuff. Oh, um, I know what I was going to say. Um, so during my little hiatus sort of thing from making YouTube videos, um... I started listening to this one podcast, and um, I don't know if any of you guys watch uh, The Office, or if you guys have like seen The Office before, um, but if you haven't, and you don't know about it, which I, I don't know how you wouldn't know about The Office, but anyways, if, if you don't know about it, it's this one TV show uh, that came out years and years ago. Um, it was originally a British TV show, um, and it probably came out early 2000s, um, but at some point it was adapted into a, uh, there was, it was like adapted into a US version of The Office, and the whole premise of the show is like the daily lives of like people working in a, uh, in an office that's for a paper company. And, uh, yeah, it's just a really funny TV show, and it's really good. Um, but I hope you guys die. Please die. No, die. There we go. Why do you guys gotta keep on shooting at me? I'm trying to explain a story. Or, it's not really a story, but still, I'm trying to speak. I don't appreciate all the gunfire. Um, ah, oh, come on, quit it. Quit it. I don't like you. Just die. There's so much gunfire. Oh, boy. Uh, 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 shut the door. What is this terminal? Turret control system. Okay, we need to deactivate this right now. Uh, forgotten? Three of nine, correct. What humankind, what is, like, the... Would it be... Oh, boy. N and, uh... And, uh, it's probably not humankind. I'm guessing it's not humankind. Respected. Could it be respected? Five of nine, okay. Present. I'm guessing it's like R E S E D. Could it be respect? Oh, wait, collector. I didn't even see this one. Uh, R E C. Uh, R E C T. 
I don't think it's collector. Uh, I think it could be presented though. Four of nine, but wait. Ah, oh, gosh. Okay. Well, where's our things that can help us out? <laughs> Dud removed. That's no good. I need a refresh thing. I'm a bob. Dud removed. No. Are there no more of the refresher things? Do we just need to take a shot in the dark? Oh boy. Oh boy. I don't see any more of the refresher things. Oh uh, no. Okay, so five of nine. Which one was that? That was respected, right? Collector presented forbidden. Uh. What else is, like, respected? Uh... Doctrine? Uh... Could it be doctrine? Concealed? I'm gonna go doctrine. Ah, oh, crap. Okay. Well, I done goofed. The turrets are ow. The turrets are still an owie. No, just die, turret. I don't appreciate you. I don't like you at all. Oh, more, more of them. Why? Ow. Stop. Stop. Nobody likes you. Okay. I think everyone has been taken care of. Now we can just go and take some ammo off of their bodies. What kind of armor am I wearing, by the way? I, let's see. Vault 101 jumpsuit. Small guns plus 5, energy weapons plus 5. We got a vault helmet. We should probably find some new armor. Do we really want to wear raider armor, though? Probably not. Let's wait to find some more. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know how I've been wearing the vault armor this whole time. I probably should have got like some of the armor from the Brotherhood of Steel and wore that but too late now uh, let's drink some purified water anyways back to what I was saying about the office um, I'm a little hiatus from YouTube my little vacation I started listening to this one podcast um, about the office and it's hosted by Jenna Fisher and Angela Kinsey. And uh, if you know anything about The Office, those names should be familiar to you. Because, oh, oh landmine. <laughs> but uh, like I was saying, those names should be familiar to you. Because um, Angela Kinsey plays Angela Martin on The Office. And Jenna Fisher plays Pam Beasley. Um... So, yeah, they host the podcast, and the whole, like, premise of the podcast is not to die. Um, but, oh, no, why are you killing me so hard? Oh, boy. Oh, what are, why ghouls now? I mean, I appreciate you helping me, but... Wait, can I, like, can you... Oh, I don't have enough AP. Dang it. Uh, 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 now you can die? Crap. There we go. Okay. Like I was saying, uh, Angela Kinsey and Jenna Fisher, don't come in here. Just, no. Ah, okay. Yeah, like I was saying, <laughs> uh, Angela Kinsey and Jenna Fisher host the podcast, and each week they watch another episode. Like, they, oh boy. Um, so they started on, like, the first episode of The Office, and throughout the whole, like, lifespan of their podcast, they're gonna go through the whole series of The Office, which is, like, 200 episodes, and they're gonna re they're gonna re -weech. <laughs> they're gonna re-watch, um, every episode, and they're gonna give, like, a breakdown of the episode, and so, uh... Yeah, I've been catching up on that podcast, and I just caught up. I just got caught up tonight, um, and they just did the first Christmas episode um, in season two. We're still over encumbered. 
Jeez. Okay. There we go. And they just did the first Christmas episode in season two where they do Yankee Swap. And uh, they're all supposed to get each other gifts that are like no more than $20. And Michael gets uh, it's like a $400 iPod. <laughs> Everyone gets pissed off at him. But uh, yep, they went through and they kind of dissected that whole episode. And that is radiation down there. I don't appreciate that. Uh, can we, like, heal up a bit real quick? Do we got some Stimpex? And now let's do some Radex. Wait, was it only this area with the... Did I just use a Radex for this? Uh, 10 millimeter round Stimpex. Okay, that's kind of cool. Oh, uh -huh. that was kind of a waste of Radex, though. Uh, how far until we get to where we're going? Oh boy, quite the distance. Quite the distance. But yep, so I've been listening to that podcast. And uh, if you guys are interested in checking it out, it's on Spotify. And it's called The Office Ladies. Really good podcast. Even if you're not really like a fan of the show... They still have some, like, entertaining commentary, and it's just, like, good background noise, to be honest. But, um, yeah, if you're not into the show, then I would also recommend listening to the podcast and, like, following along with the show, because that could be a really fun thing to do. And I don't know if I want to go up here and explore these areas, because I feel like I'm just going to get lost up here, and there's enemies. Oh, how'd I miss that? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh boy. I don't like where this is going. I like where that one. Oh boy. No, come on. Just die. Oh, I thought I was going to be able to get him from there. No, stop. That's not fair. That's not fair. BB guns. BB guns. BB guns. Just die. Just die. Oh boy. I fell. Uh, uh, shotgun. Uh, what? Uh, uh. No, why are you not dead? I just wasted a lot of ammo there. <laughs> just mindlessly shooting. But whatever. It's all good. We've got 107 rounds still. Why is there so many ghouls in here, though? I don't understand this. And I don't even know if that one perk that we got that, like, gives the random chance with the dice. I don't even know what that's doing right now. I'll have to research that more. <laughs> Uh, oh, we're definitely gonna get lost up here, though. Let's just continue on our journey of where we're trying to get to. Because I feel like that'll be our best option. I don't think we should go exploring right now, considering we're trying to find our daddy. And, uh, try and find out where he wants to. And there are some ah! doggies here. No, where's my shotgun? There it is. Uh, why are you not dying? I don't appreciate this. I don't want to shoot a dog, but I have to. There we go. Finally dying. Yeah, let's take their dog meat. And let's go and eat it, because they were attacking me, so now I'm gonna eat their dog meat up. That sounded wrong, but you guys know what I meant. Oh, more. More dog meat. Perfect. Let's go and eat it up. <laughs> uh, Raider Badland armor. No, I want some cooler armor than Raider. Museum station. Is that where we came into? Museum station? I think so, yeah. We're not getting any closer to Rivet City. This is not good. Oh boy. I think that's... This is like where I'm going to leave this episode off it for now because... I think I've been recording for a little while, and uh, hopefully it's enough uh, footage to keep you guys entertained, and yeah, hopefully I try and stick to a more consistent upload schedule from here on out. I don't know. We'll see what happens. No promises, but yeah. <laughs> uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you'd like to see more content like this, maybe... 
uh, if I decide to upload, then maybe consider hitting that subscribe button. And I don't know why there's all this gunfire up here. I don't want to know and find out what's happening. We'll find out what's happening in the next episode. So if you want to see that, hit that red subscribe button. And uh, yeah, drop a like, maybe a comment, something. I don't know. Thank you guys for watching, and I will catch you all later. Goodbye.